the kids are in school. I just got back from dropping Annie and Lucy off, and Annie is having a lot of adjustment issues. I really don't know what where this is coming from because the first week of school, she absolutely loved it. But lately, when I go to drop her off and sign her in, she throws this epic, like she's on the verge of a meltdown. You can always tell. You can always tell when a meltdown is going to happen. So, I catch it just in the nick of time. I, 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 I have to wait there. I have to calm her down before I send her in the class because otherwise it's going to be a complete nightmare. and She's never going to make it and her day is going to be totally messed up and ruined. So, what I, I've been doing, I've been just kind of sticking around for maybe 10 or 15 minutes kind of cop, kind, kind of calming her down and um now she gets breakfast at home around 6 30 and they eat breakfast at school about 8 30. i always give her something to eat at home because they run breakfast really late for the kids over at the school so i always stick around until they line up for breakfast and they take the kids up to the cafeteria to eat um i did that today i walked her in line and she went to the cafeteria now before this i tried to leave as soon as they went up the stairs, I tried, as soon as they were going up the stairs, I tried to veer in the other direction to go out the door. She ran after me. The other people, the other teachers and assistants that were still in the hallway thought she was trying to run from school. They grabbed her because they didn't see she was, you know, trying to come after me. They didn't realize I was still there. They grabbed her, which of course escalated things even more. Um, they didn't, they didn't manhandle her. They weren't, they didn't hurt her at all. They just stopped her from, you know, leaving the school. I turn around, she's on the floor, she's screaming. I go back, pick her up, calm her down. As soon as this kid lines up for breakfast, she's A-OK. -okay. Nothing ever happened, right? So, so here's the thing, here's what I'm gonna do. We have an IEP meeting coming up. Well, we have to schedule it, but it's supposed to be like within the next week. Um, I'm going to ask for a one-on-one -on -one assistant, or if I can do the one-on-one -on -one myself, for you know just for the few minutes like for the first hour of school and I'm going to ask for not only fidget toys which I can probably buy myself there you can find fidget toys anywhere um, and then I'm going to also ask for a physical therapist because she hates those stairs with a passion she's always tripping she's always falling she's all she's fallen up twice so far this year going down the stairs so I'm gonna ask for a physical therapist for the school a one-on-one -on -one, the fidget toys and I'm gonna ask to have snacks on hand for her because what I'm thinking there could be a blood a sugar issue there somewhere now my husband is a type 2 diabetic and I have hypoglycemia so it's very possible that her blood sugar is spiking or going down because of the meltdowns causing it to escalate even worse so what I'm going to do during the IEP meeting, I'm going to have it listed that she has, you know, some type of healthy snack on her during the day just to kind of, you know, just to kind of see if that's the situation or not. I, I've never, I've never had her, her blood sugar tested ever, but they could trigger, you know, episodes. So just kind of keep small little healthy snacks on hand and see if that has any role in it or not. And then if it does, then I'm gonna go to the doctors and say, hey, look, this is what's going on, and I want her blood sugar tested. So, right now, I'm at the Dollar General store. I have to get some cleaning supplies because Jaina's birthday party is Saturday, and I only have like a couple of days to get my house in order. It's not messy, it's not bad, but I do have kids, so it's, it's more like organized chaos right now. And I'm gonna go in, get some stuff, and then run back home. So, it's time for Lucy's soccer practice. Um, yes, I have coffee. I'm really flipping tired and I have no idea why I didn't do a lot today. I didn't even do as much as I had planned, but that's okay. I kind of, um, enjoyed my day off too. But don't judge me because of my coffee. Because I'm pretty sure some of these parents have a little something extra special, special in their cup. And I guarantee you it's not coffee. Just take a hint, okay? Ready to go home? Yes. Uh... Let's go home and get a shower and get something to eat. You look really cute with your hair pulled up. Taking it down? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it feels so painful. And my um, shin guards always keep You 
can take your shin guards off. You're in the car, babe. I know. They're cute. Let me see them on you. They're Look, cute. Looks like I have pink skin. Yeah. But they protect, ah! but they protect you. I know. But they run me down at the same time. Ah. Just, t honey, yeah, just take everything off. You're in the car. It's not a big deal. Okay, okay Mama. Okay. You want a big, you want one of the brats? Yeah. I cooked some brats before I left, and the kids call them big sausages. I don't like the word brat. Well, honey, the brats are short for bratwurst. Oh, what so, does that mean? it's just a kind of sausage, sweetie. Ooh, Here. Soft. Ugh. Get your stinky feet off my dash. Can you please help me? <laughs> yes, here. You got stinky feet, do you? No. Do your feet stink. Uh, Here. Here, sweetie. Okay. You gotta push it off. Ah! Uh, but the thing. Lucy, your, <laughs> your feet are in my. Uh, Alright, here. Pull this out. Wait, you can pull it out? Yes. And then pull this down. Those, those go back in, sweetie. Those are removable so you can wash these. Uh, See? Uh, Oop, there we go. Can no, you get the other one? Uh, I think so. Take uh, that one out. Yay. And then pull the other one down. Just don't lose those pieces because they go back in your sock. Yeah, okay. Were you the goalie again today? Yeah. Yeah. Do you like being the goalie? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, Here. Just, uh, Slide it over your heel. Uh, so hard. Here. Slide it over your heel. Oh, and then, there you go. Take it off. Oh. There you go. Look, look. Ew. What? Don't lose those. Nope, I won't. Gonna drive home, okay? So I have to get Lucy in the bath. Um, she might have to miss pack this on Saturday because it's Jana's birthday and I won't have my car because we already have that day planned out. I didn't know she had practice until I didn't know she had practice until Saturday until the until today because the new schedule came out today. Put her down. Let her go. So Lucy might have to miss Saturday. Let her go. Come here. Let's get ready for your bath. Come here. That's hot. No. You're sweaty. What? All right, guys. I'll see you later. Bye.